Well, a glorious day in Prague for the 19th edition of this truly historic marathon. IAAF gold label status race, possibly even too warm for one or two of these competitors. But there is a record field of 9,500 here for a race that over the years has attracted some really high quality athletes and some decent races. Big group of elite men head over the famous Charles Bridge. Group of about 15 of them in these early stages. Including Nicholas Kemboy, fourth fastest of all time over 10,000 metres. That's Homolach, leading athlete from the Czech Republic, aiming to be national champion once again. Lydia Cheromai in the women's race set a course record here of 2.22 a couple of years ago. She's got Kiros for company and so too Caroline Rotich. Rotich on the far side there. The elite men greeted by a huge crowd here. Just gone beyond the 10k point. Very well supported marathon. Kenboy looking pretty sprightly at the front of that field. Ahanu's in there as well. He was second in Rome a couple of months ago. Lomarinyan of Kenya and these three forming a little bit of a breakaway here. Now we get into the race proper. Bit of a problem for Kenboy, perhaps a little stumble on the cobbles. He's only lost 10 or 15 metres on the Ethiopian and the Kenyan. Now the three are reunited. Kenboy and Lomarinyan, these two out front. Who will be the first to break? And it was Lomarinyan because Nicholas Kenboy has the advantage and as we turn our attention to the women's race, Caroline Rotich in the lead, 2.23 in Chicago last autumn, won the New York half earlier this year, so she's in good form. Phyllis Ongori of Kenya in second, Ahitu Kiros second in Dubai at the start of the year. Those two very close together in second and third, so a good battle between Kenya and Ethiopia, but it's all Nicholas Kemboy, the former Kenyan, now representing Qatar as... Bahanu now goes past the tiring Lomarinyan and the Ethiopian runner-up spot in Italy a couple of months ago and he's looking as though he's going to do the same here Tere, former world bronze medalist at junior level over the 3000 meter steeplechase won in Turin last autumn and he too has gone past a tiring Lomarinyan but this victory is going to go to Nicholas Kemboy a brilliant performer on the track over 10,000 metres, now making his name as a marathon runner. And he becomes the Prague Marathon Champion for 2013, just inside 2.09. Good performance from Gourmet Bahanu, once again finishing second, as he did in Rome. And a grimacing Patrick Terrer comes home for third, just outside 2.10. But that is a good run from the Kenyan. So as the celebrations continue for the elite men, the elite women closing in on the end, Caroline Rotich trying to get all the liquid on board she can. It has been a very, very hot day here in Prague, but what a classy performance. She's miles out front and can really afford to enjoy these closing stages. She was only 29th in Daegu a couple of years ago in the World Championship Marathon, but she's a much better athlete than that, and she's proving it here today in the sunshine of the Czech Republic. A really good run. She's going to be around about 2.27. Very much enjoying a great reception and a fine bit of pacing there. All the way through that race, gave herself a huge advantage. Phyllis Ongori does win the battle for second. She comes through just inside 2.29, wave of the arms. And Ahitu Kiros who was second in Dubai at the start of the year, follows that up with third here in Prague. So Nicholas Kemboy very much enjoying his win. He was in command all the way through that race. Looked as though he had a real spring in his step. Bahanu second to rare third. And another Kenyan-born athlete celebrating victory in the women's race. Caroline Rotich on Gori second and Kiros completing the podium in the women's race.